This short video shows how to properly position and secure the non-an 8008J infant and 8001J neonate size sensors using disposable 8008JFW or 8001JFW flexi wraps. Flex Series Sensors and Flexi Wrap Adhesive Wraps are a two-part sensor product. The Flex Series Sensors may be used multiple times for the same patient or used for another patient with proper cleaning and a new Flexi Wrap. The Flexi Wrap is designed to secure the sensor in position on the large toe of infants or the lateral foot of neonates up to 4 pounds or 2 kilograms in weight. Several sizes may be used for adult and pediatric finger placement as well. Watch that video for a finger placement demonstration. These sensors should only be secured with the matching size flexi wrap. Other adhesives or tapes will not properly position the sensor and may cause damage to it. Each sensor has an emitter that projects a tuned light wave pattern and a detector which receives that light. The heartbeat creates a signal detectable throughout the arteries. This signal is detected by the light waves and used for both measuring pulse rate and oxygen saturation in the arterial blood. The emitter and detector must be directly facing each other and secured to provide accurate measurement. The emitter should rest directly across from the detector on the other side of the toe or foot. Non-inflex sensors are designed for use with a wide range of non-in oximeters. Remember, Non-in sensors are designed for use with non-in brand pulse oximeters only. Do not use non-in brand sensors with other brand pulse oximeter devices, which may provide inaccurate results. Wash and dry the foot where the sensor will be placed. Heavy lotions, sunscreens, oils, and dirt may alter the accuracy of the sensor, so start with a clean, dry toe or foot. Place the flex sensor and a new flexi wrap on a clean work surface. Make sure the sensor is clean and free from adhesive or debris from previous use. Partially peel back the adhesive backing tab on the flexi wrap so the sensor area adhesive is exposed. Align the sensor emitter and detector, skin contacting side up, to fit in the cutouts on the wrap. Then, gently press the sensor into place on the wrap. The cable should extend beyond the wrap supported by the adhesive and tab on the wrap. Remove the adhesive backing from the rest of the wrap. For placement on the large toe of an infant over 4 pounds in weight, place the adhesive and detector portion on the bottom center of the toe, with the cable running back toward the heel. Now, wrap the sensor on top of the toe, placing the emitter on the top of the toe, across from the detector on the bottom of the toe. Gently wrap the tab over the tip of the toe to overlap and secure the sensor to the toe. It's a good idea to gently secure the sensor cable independently from the sensor along the bottom of the foot toward the heel. For placement on the foot of a neonate, four or less pounds in weight, place the adhesive and detector portion on the bottom center of the foot at the base of the toes with the cable running back toward the heel. Now, wrap the sensor on top of the foot, aligning the top portion with the sensor portion on the bottom of the foot. It's a good idea to gently secure the sensor cable independently from the sensor along the bottom of the foot or at the ankle, depending on the foot size. For both infants and neonates, don't wrap the sensors or tape too snugly. Tight wrapping can restrict blood flow and affect sensor accuracy. You're ready to plug the sensor into the non-impulse oximeter to measure oxygen saturation and pulse rate. Non-impulse oximeters have a pulse signal quality display that measures the sensor signal. If the signal is low, the emitter and detector may not be in proper alignment. Reposition the sensor to see if a stronger signal can be obtained. If repositioning does not increase the signal quality, try a different site or check that the patient's foot is warm, relaxed, and well perfused.
Check the sensor portion and connection every 6 to 8 hours or per your institutional policy. Also, check for skin irritation and loosening of the adhesive from movement over time. To remove the sensor, simply disconnect from the oximeter and reverse the direction of the tab wrap to gently remove it. The same wrap may be reused on the same patient as long as the adhesive is intact. For a new patient, a new flexi wrap must be used. Remove the flex sensor from the flexi wrap and discard the wrap. The flex sensor can be cleaned for use with a different patient. To clean, you can wipe all patient contact surfaces of the sensor with the soft cloth dampened with a 10% bleach solution. Do not use caustic or ammonium chloride based cleaners, which may damage the sensor elements. Do not sterilize, autoclave, or immerse the sensor in liquid of any kind. Do not pour or spray any liquids onto the sensor. Wipe away from the plug on the cable toward the sensor. Allow the sensor to completely dry and check that all adhesive from the previous use has been removed before the next application. You may rotate to the other foot on the patient to maintain skin integrity and patient comfort. You can find additional use information on this and other Nonin products at www.nonin.com.